Trotters moving into position on the gate for the second race, a full field of 10 to contest the first of the OSS grassroots divisions tonight, 4-5 to five on 6, Judge Ken. On the heels of a second place finish in his most recent performance, four top three finishes from six starts this year for that trotting son of Justice Hall. Post time for the second race. Second race, Trotfield picks up speed. And they're off, Saftik tried timing the eight, Zorkvik Tim blew up. Zorkvik Tim off stride getting out of there. So Judge Can, the favorite, is going to rock it out to grab the top for Henry. Second away at the rail, left out Radical Roy. Then it's Roy Al Elite from in third, fourth out there to around town. Backed up inside from in fifth is Warawi Usain. Then Arcanum is sixth off the speed. Justice for Narnia is going to find the seven hole into the turn. Then it's further back to Never Tell. Racing second from last is Northern Tailwind. And after the anxious start, Zorkvik Tim is far, far back. 28 and 2, they lit up that first quarter. Backstretch bound chasing the colors of Henry as he leads with Judge Ken. Judge Ken on top the lead too. Back in second, Radical Roy. Then third to Royal Elite and around town fourth. Fifth inside to Warawi Usain. Bayarshan is underway with Arcanum now from in sixth, leaving seventh to Justice for Narnia. And the other two with the field are Never Tell and Northern Tailwind. Two more lengths back ninth. Here's the opening half and it's 59 and two. A second quarter of 31. They move into the far turn. Judge Judge Ken getting things his own way. Here's pressure from Arcanum on the outside into second now. Then it's Radical Roy third, glued to cover Justice for Narnia fourth. Fifth inside as they round the turn is Royal Elite. Then it's around town, bottled up sixth inside, seven to the outside as they make their way to three quarters is Never Tell. Then a gapping war are we Usain. Around him is Northern Tailwind. They're up to three quarters next. And the leader continues to be Judge Ken. Dropped in second for brief cover is Arcanum. He gets bravened up at three quarters in one 28 and 3, but a two length lead for Judge Ken, who kicks away in deep stretch now. Judge Ken is all by himself. Then it's back inside to Arcanum. Outside speed late from Royale Elite. Now escaping far outside is around town. They're in deep stretch. Judge Ken is still there. The lead three lengths. Here's Royale Elite closing hard on the outside. Henry calls on Judge Ken for more. He needs more. Here on the outside is Royale Elite getting him. Royale Elite talk about pickpocketing one right on the money. That's what he did. 158 and 3. Top four finishers on the board for tonight's second race. We have three, six, five, and four. Back to victory lane, capturing tonight's second race. Number three is Royale Elite, the points leader 
In the grassroots program in this division this year, Royale Elite, a two-year-old royalty for life colt out of the Muscles Yankee mare, Daydream is owned by the Hudson Standardbred Stable of Hudson, Quebec. They're homebred trained by Mark Stacy, and was driven to victory tonight by James McDonald. So from four OSS grassroots starts this year, that's now three victories and a third place finish. Royale Elite victorious here tonight in 158 and three. Three six five four top four finishers. Three Royale Elite paid fifteen forty. The two dollar exact to thirty one ninety. Two dollar daily double twenty seven sixty. Dollar trifecta fifty nine seventy. Dollar superfecta returned one sixty nine thirty.